What is going on everybody? Welcome to another episode of Comic Card Checklist. And today's episode, we're going to be doing 2013 Spider-Man Heroes and Villains. Um, it's probably not as popular as other card sets. Uh, and it's also a card game set. So, um, but I'd like, I'd just like to go over the whole uh, set and also um, unpack some packs. I think I, I purchased 10 recently and I wanted to get this episode over with and just, you know, open the packs in camera. But um, this set is not that big in the US. And of course, that's because this set is only available in uh, Europe, UK to be uh, more specific. So you guys could see Marvel 2013 produced by I don't know if you guys could see it. Uh, Eagle Moss Publishing Group. <clears throat> and this set is a fairly large set. It consists of... <clears throat> see if you could see it here. Um, <clears throat> the Spider-Man <clears throat> Heroes and Villains Power Card Collection set is made up of 275 cards in total. 226 regular cards, which comes uh, uh, in seven in every pack. So each pack has eight. So seven of these would be our base cards or regular cards. 33 cards are rare, which is one in every 10 packs. Then we have um, 10 super rare cards, which comes in one in every six packs. And six ultra rare cards, one in every 24 packs. So let me see if I said that right. I kind of can't see it that well. So yeah, pretty much uh, 275 card set, 226 are regular, 33 are rare, 10 are super rare, and six are ultra rare. <clears throat> so one thing I've noticed about this set is that... Um, We'll, we'll take a look at the base cards right now. So typically the base card will have the number of the card. So it's from 1 to 275. Is that right? Yeah, two, 275. Uh, the character's name. And um, <clears throat> I guess uh, powers and stats. I don't really play this game. I just collect the card. So I'm not going to talk about any of the... Um, as far as, you know, how this game works, so. But anyway, I've also found that there's two variation, but when I talked to the person that that was selling it, he didn't even know that uh, there was two variations. But I'll show you guys um what I mean. So pretty much, uh, this is about number eight, Dr. Doom. And... The variation is that uh, here it says Power Card Collection, and here it also said Power Card Collection, but underneath there's a Marvel logo, which the other one doesn't have, and also a 2013 Marvel. So that's the main difference between the two sets, and I want to say um, you could get the whole uh, 275 sets with the Marvel logo and also the whole 275 set without the Marvel logo. So I actually have, I'm close to completing both of them. For the one that requires the Marvel logo, I think I only need um, three cards. And for the one that doesn't, I think I still need around six cards. So hopefully I, I get some today, but as we open these packs, I'm not exactly sure. I purchased it from a seller in UK, so I'm not exactly sure which uh, type of cards I'm going to get. If it's the Marvel or without the Marvel logo. But I guess we'll find that, we'll find that if it's consistent with um, every pack I open. So, because I'm not sure. Um, they're both from UK and I'm, you know, I have two different versions and... Um, I, Supposedly, there's supposed to be only one. So, <clears throat> but anyway, um, besides getting it in a pack of eight, 
you could also get it in a tin set and the tin the tin looks like this it's got the spider-man on top you got the heroes and villains so got carnage and venom electro on one side sandman on this side uh green goblin pretty much the spider-man no no way home uh cast and here is where it was produced from so in london um eagle moss publishing group <clears throat> take a look inside it's just uh, empty and it says here contains five packs of eight spider-man cards but i'm pretty sure we could fit a lot more than that as i think we could fit all 10 in here so <clears throat> but anyway um I will show you guys the cards first and then we'll open the packs and hopefully um I get some stuff that uh that I need. Um <clears throat> but I'm not sure how the rarity goes, right? And as far as this uh, uh this thing right here, it says that 226 are regular, 33 are rare, 10 are super rare and 6 are ultra rare. So um <clears throat> The way this card is set up, the card set, it's it has uh, many different types. Um, so I want to assume that the regular cards like these are the ones that are um, regular cards. That's the 200 and, 226 regular cards. <clears throat> and I want to say that the foil, which looks like this... So pretty much the same exact card except it has the foil front is the the 33 rare cards. So hopefully there's 33 of these foil cards. And then the super rare I'm going to assume is uh the foil with the with the wave on it. Is the super rare? Uh, we'll see. I'll, I'll count how many of these there are. And if this is correct, then there should be 10 of these. And then the ultra rare, I want to say is the 3D lenticular cards. Um, <clears throat> Let me see if I could find one. It's got to be here somewhere. So pretty much it's just... uh, If you guys are familiar with the Marvel 3D, it looks like that card. And... I'm not seeing. Of course, there's only uh. If this is correct, there should only be six, six of them, and I think what I might be missing are also the the lenticular cards because they're uh they're the super rare. So here's one. <clears throat> this one is uh Iron Spider. Um, I don't know if you could see the 3D effect in camera, but. Uh, I guess you could kind of see his hand is like uh like like off the page a little bit, but not really. So yeah, so the the 3D ones are the super rare, but I don't like the way they have this arranged because the way they have it arranged, it's 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 just random. It's like um regular card, regular card, foil, regular card, foil, and then lenticular and then uh wave pattern so it's there's no like standard that are you know like 1 to 100 would be the base and then 101 to 120 would be the foil and then 130 uh you know i like it um like in tiers where <clears throat> some card sets are but for some reason this card set is just um all over all over the place with that so you just have uh Pretty much, you either know uh, which cards are the rares and um, which ones are not. And this set does not come with a checklist. <clears throat> also, another thing I want to point out is, um, like I told you guys before, the these two, it seems uh, that the wave pattern for uh, the one with the emblem goes um, horizontally. And the one for the the one without the emblem goes vertically. So I found that uh pretty um pretty much in line with all the cards that I have that are 
non uh, marvel they're all um the wave is up and down by side to side so <clears throat> but i'll go through the cards and um let's let's verify all that information <clears throat> so we got spider-man uncle ben human torch with the wave pattern going this way um vermin <clears throat> a foil goblin Black Widow, Captain America with the foil, Doctor Doom, I guess uh, Hydra Man, there's also a Sandman, and I put the cards right in the back of them, so pretty much, you know, I have both sets, since um, all of them have the same exact common backs. Uh, here we have Grizzly, Iceman, and then a foil Sandman, a uh, foil Venom, a regular Jackal, Gwen Stacy, Hawkeye, Foil Doctor Strange, Madam Web. I guess the ones that um <clears throat> that are dark on camera are pretty much the foils. I guess they don't reflect reflect that well. So <clears throat> at least uh the way uh my light is currently set up. So we got this uh character, King Guru. I have no clue who he is. Uh, Scorpion, uh, <clears throat> the wave pattern, of course. And let me see if uh, we have that up and down pattern for the other side. And of course we do. So yeah, I guess that's how you'll know, at least for the, uh, only for these cards, that one has uh, up and down and one has side to side. And pretty much only these cards are, you're going to be able to tell the difference between the two sets. Without looking at the back, of course. So, Spider Woman, um, Hammerhead, Shocker, Stegron. <clears throat> he looks like a dinosaur slash human. Uh, Bluebird, Arcade. Um, <clears throat> guess I'm missing. Um, who's missing? Hammerhead. <coughs> Card number 23. And then we got Dr. Octopus. Uh, no clue who White Rabbit is. The Thing, Yellow Jacket, Foil, Carry On and Aunt May, Captain America, uh, Britain, Moon Knight, Puppet Master. Again, here, like, there's two foils in a row. And <clears throat> was there, like, two foils in a row? Yeah, I guess there's two foils in a row here. I mean, maybe there is a pattern, but... I mean, one foil here and then one foil here. So I, I don't know, guys. Uh, <laughs> they just did it randomly. Um, <clears throat> I don't know who Betty Bryant is. Red Skull, Robbie Robertson. You got a foil Vulture, Vulture and Blade. Uh, Luke Cage, Cardiac, Super Skull and Kane. <clears throat> uh, Mind Worm, Misty Knight, Foil Punisher. Dastler, Molten Man, Juggernaut. I'm not recognizing some of these characters. Um, <clears throat> Living Brain, no clue who he is. But I do know Morbius. He has a movie coming up. Nightmare. <clears throat> Puma, Silver Sable. Oh, that's a pretty nice carnage right there. Full of carnage. <clears throat> Daredevil looks nice too. Uh, Liz Osborn, Beetle. Gibbon, Lizard, Sin Eater, Dum Dum Dogen, part of the Howling Commandos with Nick Fury, I'm guessing, Bench Urich, Foil Black Cat, Big Man, Frogman, Speed Demon. I, I don't see, uh, I guess the Lenticular cards are really rare because we haven't uh, hit one yet and we're almost up to 75. We got Kingpin, uh, no clue who Willow was. Will O the Wisp is Captain Universe, Scarlet Witch, Foil Iron Man, Ghost Rider looks good in this one. Shade Black Fox. Dude looks like a Batman, like a knockoff Batman. Um Man Wolf uh foil. A doppelganger, type of Mary, different costume. Haven't seen it before. Rocket Racer. I don't know why he reminds me of uh, Static for some reason. Um, Foil Flash Thompson, Submariner, <clears throat> Scryers, no clue who he is. 
Shadrock, no clue who he is. Um, Electro, very, very familiar, especially with uh, Jamie Foxx portraying him in the recent movie. No clue who George Stacy is. I'm assuming Gwen Stacy's father. Ricochet, Nick Fury, Foil, Medusa, Scorcher, Calypso, Mary Jane, another Foil, <clears throat> Lockjaw, Toxin. Mm, Toxin looks toxic here. Got Beast, Foil, Rhino, Vision, Mr. and Mrs. Parker. All right, is that when they have children? Uh, Crime Master, or is that supposed to be Peter and that's Peter's parents? Um, that, that would make more sense, right? <laughs> uh, Peter Parker, we got Foil, Stunner, Trapster, Chance. You got some of your uh, B-rated thug class um, super villains, I'm guessing. Mysterio, then we have a wave pattern conundrum. And let's see if I have the other conundrum. And yes, I do. The vertical and horizontal waves. Ned Leeds. <clears throat> hmm. Is that like a different Hobgoblin? Uh, Man Thing. Chameleon. Foil. Solo. Ooh, nice silver su surfer foil. Um, task Mac Taskmaster. Nocturn. Another wave pattern. And this is... Power pack? Ooh, who am I missing here? <clears throat> and I am missing... Oh, a lenticular card, uh, 3D. This is Bullseye at 119. So, I need a Bullseye that's, uh, that has the Marvel logo on it. Shriek, Mendel Storm, Art Man, Aunt. <laughs> Ant-Man, Electro-Proof, no clue who Electro-Proof is. Is that like Spider-Man that's like Electric-Proof? Um, no clue who Walrus is. Ar Arana, um, Spidey Armor, Wizard, Lifrag, Black Panther, Foil, nice. Also a nice uh, lenticular of uh, Iron Spider. Let me see if I have both. I do have both of them and yeah, there's really no difference for the lenticular between the two. Only the wave uh, foils are. Also, they're thicker, a lot thicker than um the regular card. Oh, I also forgot to mention, guys, that these are uh, a little bit longer. I will um. I'll show you guys a comparison uh, when I I'll grab like a normal card and you guys can see how much uh how much uh, longer it is. So <clears throat> we got the amazing Bagman, okay, Team Stone, Captain Marvel, Cloak, Tinkerer, Spider Man twenty two eleven. Have not heard of him. Deathlock, Mask Marvel, Thanos, Thanos. Uh. <clears throat> Thanos looks pretty powerful. I've been looking at a uh, <laughs> cloak. Uh, looks really weak, but look at like look at Thanos' stats. Uh, six arm Spider Man. Okay, I'm guessing Thanos would be uh the strongest right now. Uh, Death's Head, Ezekiel, Earth. Oh wait, we got uh Beyonder here. Let's see how uh Beyonder stocks stacks up with um. Uh, with Thanos, got a 497 versus 489. Is that like a light bulb? What is that? I'm guessing that's um, intelligence. Uh, 499 out of 473. Uh, is that like health for heart? 378 and he's got 498 of uh, speed. And then... It, that's like a hand logo. Maybe it's like per power. He's got 475 and 455. And then he's got a star. I don't know what that means. But he only has 135. And Thanos has 334. There's no way. It looks like Thanos' stats are higher than the Beyonders. Which is... 
beyond me. <laughs> but anyway, we'll move on. Cyclone, Falcon, Symbiote. All the base cards. Spider, Carnage, Swarm, Scorpion, and Spidey. Dominique. And I'm missing one card here. Which I think is the super rare card uh, spot. Number 158. Another rare super card here. Boomerang. I don't know if you guys could see the 3D effect. I guess I only have uh, this version. I do not have the other version. So I still need to purchase that. And here is a bunch more... Uh, regular cards i think that might be it for our um uh special cards or oh maybe not it's just that page i had all base cards but uh i guess we'll keep moving on spider side don't know who he is loki hulk look like he's uh being trapped but he is not getting trapped um Maybe team ups uh pretty soon here. Oh, looks like we have another um lenticular uh, dagger. <clears throat> no, which I'm also missing um the other version. So <coughs> and <coughs> I've been checking lately um to see if I could purchase the super rare cards, and it seems like they're selling um of course in a UK based seller for around like 20 to 30 bucks including shipping and of course shipping is like they're charging like 15 or 20 for shipping so but here is another lenticular card Spidey and Sandman and oh please don't tell me I only have one ah I only have one Ooh, it's gonna be expensive to uh, complete this set, but hopefully I could find one seller and complete uh, this whole set of 275. That will be 550 total cards. Um, <clears throat> so who else we got here? Iron Fist. Shh, don't know who Shock is. Rick Jones, Mad Jack, Dragon Man. Uh, Spider Hulk. He should be strong. Yeah, he's pretty strong. Uh, Kazar, Burglar, Mirage, Spider Lizard. He's he's pretty much combined with like the whole Sinister Six or something. Um, <clears throat> who's missing here? Uh, we are missing Spider Man 2099. And here we have Lenticular, or sorry, uh, oh, Wave <clears throat> Foil, Mr. Fantastic. Yes, very nice. Oh, God, man, Mr. Hyde, Manga Universe Spidey, Spider Girl, Spider Woman 2, Phil Ulrich, Yurik, <clears throat> Nightcrawler, Nova, Shatra, Wasp, Harry Osborn, Alistair Smite. I know that guy, Wonder Man. Spider-Man Megamorph. What is Spider-Man Megamorph? I have no clue what that is. Is that like a robot? <clears throat> um, Razorback. Okay, he looks like a... He has like a... <clears throat> who's that? Uh, from the Lion King? I forgot the, the, the boar. <laughs> Pum Timo Pumba. Is it Timon and Pumba? Yeah. He looks like uh, Pumba's uh, top. Or at least he's wearing that hood. Um, <clears throat> Debbie Whitman. No clue who he is. No clue who Thousand is. Prowler. Professor Prowler. Okay. White Tiger. I do want to see a movie on uh, Co Cosmic Spider-Man. Um, can't wait for that. But I don't know if he's going to have a storyline because, huh, I would think his uh, <clears throat> power ratings would be like super high, but I guess not. Um, looks like it's on par with the black costume Spider-Man. <clears throat> Homebag Colin Wing. 
I didn't even know uh, the character Colin Wing and Iron Fist for a while, but now that I'm looking at these older cards, uh, 2013, apparently, like, she's been around, so. <clears throat> and 231, I uh, think, are all bonus cards. So, <clears throat> I'm not exactly sure, but I think they're all just regular cards at this point, And they just give you points or something like that. Like I said, I don't play the game, so they're all just uh, <clears throat> cards to me. But, yeah, here you guys could see the whole set, which, of course, I have complete, because they're uh, pretty much like normal cards. And... 275? Am I missing 274? I guess I'm missing a Rhino and Spidey. Um, <clears throat> here I just have a error card. Uh, I don't know if you guys could tell what's wrong with this card, but uh, it doesn't look correct. Um, another error card. Yeah. It's like, I forget why... Um, I have this here. Oh, um, sh shoot. I also have a Russian version. So this is Dr. Octopus and Russia and Chameleon. And there's the back. And I have a whole bunch of these as well. Which I'll show you guys right now. Which, uh, I only, I think I only have, um, yeah, one, two, three, four, five, uh, nine, yeah, nine, so, <clears throat> ten. But yeah, so this version doesn't have the Marvel emblem either, so, this must be the correct version. But anyway, um, finally we've come to... Our point where I've shown you guys pretty much the whole card set for this. And let's see if we could complete my base, uh, my set. So that uh, I don't have to buy anymore. And we'll open these packs up. Hopefully, um, we got some uh, super rare cards. <clears throat> so, I think, like it said before, uh, you get seven base cards and then you get um, one in every pack, you should get the foil. And then one in every six packs, you should get that wave foil. And then one in 24 packs will get the lenticular. So let's see if, uh, if I get lucky and um, we get those odds or better odds than those. <clears throat> So it looks like uh, the ones I'm getting are the with the Marvel emblem. It looks like all of them uh, has that. So let's see if we got anything good. And then Leeds, Shock, Barney, Juggernaut, Invisible Woman, and Doctor Strange Foil. Oh no. So, um, I guess I should take notes from this seller that, um, his packs are the ones with the Marvel. And I'm loving how, um, easy it is to open, uh, these packs without damaging the wrapper too much as you guys know I like to collect wrappers also. But, uh, let's see if we got anything new here. <clears throat> Maybe an error card too? Nice! We got a foil power pack of the uh, wavy uh, power pack. Yeah. And we get a foil of Black Panther. Nice. That's a very nice um, hit. Traveler, Prodigy, Mirage, Robbie, Bonus Guard, and Fusion. I really like that pack. That pack was awesome. <clears throat> All right. If we get something good here. All 
the same. Nice, another one. <laughs> we have a conundrum. I don't think I need, but it's always nice to get um, wave foils. Um, no uh, foil on this one. Demo Goblin, Submariner. Moreland? Oh, we do have a foil also, and it's Wolverine. Very nice. That's two packs I'm loving. Might even be an error. No, it's not. Put that aside. <clears throat> Come on, 3D. Let me see that super rare card. Alright, everything looks good. And we have Blade Foil. Dusk, Taskmaster, Spidey, Liz Osborne, Hydra, Cardiac. And of course, uh, these will be my doubles, so I will actually be selling them. So if you guys uh, find any card that you're interest in, interested in, let me know. Because uh, I will also be uh, selling these. Yes. You guys can see I have almost, um, almost all of these will be doubles, so. And no hits. Oh, I spoke too soon. We got the Beyonder. Nice. And Rhino. So they're not placed, um, specifically in, on top or bottom. Um, <clears throat> these odds right now has been pretty nice. I'm surprised how, um, how much I'm getting between um foil and uh wave foil so and of course uh as soon as i spoke about that well this one is like a regular pack but we got electro here and we are four more packs will we get a lenticular come on show me ah messed up damage the wrapper in this one <clears throat> Let me just freak out. Ah, this one is destroyed anyway. Ah. All right, let's move on. We got anything good here? Oh, Craven, nice foil. <clears throat> I don't mind uh, getting these because. Uh, if they're in better condition, I'll definitely keep, keep them. And we are down to our last two packs with no lenticular so far. Come on, he can't be that rare. Well, I guess that's why they call it super rare, but we got Nick Fury in this one. Ooh, what is this? Do I have a short card? I guess I have a short card somewhere. Um, be like an error card or a miscut card. I always like getting uh, one of those too. I started collecting error cards too as well. <clears throat> we got Chameleon and it does not look like we're gonna get a lenticular. <clears throat> this doesn't feel any heavier but our last pack you guys let's see and nope I could already tell um, you could kind of see the uh, super rare cards because uh, it looks like it's the regular card and then it has like a, the lenticular plastic on top of it so it's just a little bit thicker but let's see who we got here and one foil. Aunt May. Not bad to end it. <clears throat> oh, um, before I forget, let's uh compare it to a regular size card. And <clears throat> we have the onslaught checklist uh available in hand and <clears throat> it's um I think it's just slightly a little bit longer and that's about it so 
and it has rounded edge but as far as thickness it's about uh, a regular card at least for the base card and as you guys could see it's um maybe i don't know that much i don't know how how much that is exactly but um quarter inch maybe i don't know but anyway um i hope you guys enjoyed this episode and i look forward to seeing you guys on my future episodes which i will be doing uh more spider-man sets that are not commonly seen so um but anyway i'll end it for this video so uh as always like share and subscribe and i'll see you guys in the next episode bye